Welcome back to another YouTube video. It is your girl Lin Wei and there's absolutely no way without going through the way and we believe that Jesus Christ is the way. I am super excited for this series that I am starting called 2023 Research slash Plan With Me where I'm going to be showing you guys all the ways I plan for the new year. <laughs> vision board the all amazing vision board i'm gonna firstly discuss why i started doing vision boards so i have like prayer i have like a prayer book where i state down that these are, these are my goals god and i want you this is what i want you to do with my goals uh there's a car passing by outside if you heard the noise i am so sorry but yes i just write it down like these are my goals god this is what i'm i i, I want you to do with them and this is what what my desires are so in general it's really just placing a demand on god that's my understanding of a vision board and why i use a vision board and my vision board is slightly different because i add in scripture and basically um like my word of the year is on my vision board so the current vision board you guys are going to see won't have my word of the year because i have not yet received it but as soon as i receive it i will update it and i will show you guys and explain to you guys how it all works so now i'm going to show you guys how i actually do my vision board like a, an entire nitty gritty this is how i do things um so i have like pinterest and canva open so i'm just gonna quickly i i had already found like a template on canva that i wanted to use and i didn't record on time that's why it's a little bit delayed but i go straight to my account and on my pinterest account and then i have a, a page that is called 2023 stuff to do so i usually label it 2023 stuff to do because i would like just save things i want to do throughout the years i mean throughout the year like next year or if i don't do them in 2020 i will do them in the next year and then i don't like save and up like save first things and then upload them i rather just like copy and paste and then they automatically upload it this is like a technique that i learned uh just by using canva for so much i use canva for like everything like most of my stuff like almost all my editing happens there um picture version editing happens there quite often but not and then i like this was a mood board uh so i didn't want that so i'm like no thank you so much canva for the great idea i'm gonna write vision board this is so cool um and probably i'll put my scripture there i don't know we'll see when i get my scripture and like my vision my word of the year and then i was just like coping and pasting like you notice that primarily most of the things are about like finishing school like okay, like ot because next year is my final year i mean 2023 is my final year so yeah i'm still yet to make my 2022 um third year experience it was a very hectic one um but as you can see there's a very important um what's the word an important thing to do which is to bring forward images so that they're not overshadowed like words especially and stuff so you just like bring them forward when you want to bring them forward and i was just doing exactly that and i'm making sure i was scaling everything properly and then i was moving around to obviously make it fit perfectly and like the way that i want it to work and then i would then like see the next picture delete and then go find the next picture like that i want to where i want to put it and yeah as you can see i was pointing it there then i saw this like i was deciding which picture to put but i wanted like a worship picture because you know most your girl is um uh, gone girl for jesus so i decided to take um the one where like she's like in front of the church i should have actually taken the one where she's kneeling um yeah i i well i like it either way so i would crop it out so i cropped it out as you can see on this the video that i that you guys are watching right now then I'll cut off where I don't think it's like fitting and then I'd have to bring like another picture that's been like pushed backwards forward so that it's still showing well the reason I use templates is exactly because of that another like editing tech like tech technique that I love on Canva is that when I like, like zoom out items like it doesn't like make them zoom out and then they're all short and everything just perfectly sets them out and then i would delete a picture that i wanted i went on to go find a picture of people studying so like i saved a lot of studying videos because i want like to continuously be inspired or like build the discipline to study so that's the reason why that image is there so i just pasted it 
right there and then put it on the side because I felt like it was a perfect fit to me. Then I obviously extended it where I could and declined it where I didn't want it to fit and then I moved on to a separate picture that I wanted to add. Even though I could have left the camera, it was a very nice picture, but it wasn't a part of my 2023 things to do, so it doesn't count. So I went on to go find another picture, and I told my parents, because I'm graduating next year, that I want a car. <laughs> you know, I always have a car in all of my vision boards. There's always a car. I don't even have my limits or license, because, like, it's important to tell God those things. Let him know your heart's desire. I don't necessarily want a Mercedes, like, to be quite exact. I just want any car, really. Like, well, not any car. Like, a nice, cute car. But not one that's, like, expensive or whatever. So I was, like, scaling it out to make sure that it fits perfectly on there. We're doing some water because, yeah, explaining a few voiceovers is hard. Okay, and then I was doing that there. Oh, I'm a little bit tired now, I want to sleep. But anyway, let's focus. So, when I was shooting this, get this, I I shot this like, this is the second time I'm shooting this video because the previous time I, my head wasn't on the shot. Like, the, the camera cut my head entirely. You, you're going to see it in, an, in another video that I'm going to post a bit later in the year. But yeah. Anyway, let's just continue before I lose focus. The girl must be focused. The girls must be focused. And then I looked for another picture. I think I took like a couple picture. I mean, relationship goals. We are here. We are here. Then I pasted it. And then I think I decided to put it on the smaller side and not where I took out the camera for some weird reason. I don't know why I didn't put it where I took out the camera. And then I put it up. I put it right down on this side of the picture. Sorry, somebody just entered the door and then like moved the camera, which is very funny. But anyway, I then scaled it properly and opened it up. And then we moved on back to um, a Pinterest version. I went back to the, to the Pinterest to sort that out. And then uh, my mom left my door open, so I need to go back, fix that quickly. Um, and then we moved on to another picture, so I just kept like editing. So, obviously, the end to like showcase graduation. Then I thought the perfect spot was right underneath that picture. Um, I think it's raining now. I'm so sorry, guys. Like, I'm back home, so it's a little, it's very hard to create content at home because one moment they're like, Hey, what are you doing? Next thing, they just, it's just, it's fun, it's just fun. Um, and then I was cutting that out and obviously I kept bringing this picture forward. I don't know why it, it kept going backwards. Then I like perfectly tried to make it fit it nicely because it's me. I mean, it must, it must look, it must look the part, you know, it must look pretty. Then I was fitting it there and I just drink some water again. Very thirsty. Um, then I fixed it there and then just continued to make it a little bit more then I just like repeated the same process um, to add back and forth then as you can see these packaging stuff then I had that edit there so yeah that is I had that edited and guys enjoyed this video and I apologize for any disturbance that occurred because I mean my mom was like I'm walking into this room either way, you know. But anyway, um, that's that's just the vibe of living and staying at home. Well, visiting home. I'm not staying here. I just came here for the holidays. But don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to this YouTube video. And I will see you guys in my next YouTube video. A video. A video.